Hi everyone, my name is Guang. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I am excited because this is something that I wanted to try. I never tried this before. Don't judge me, but I never tried Girl Scout cookies. And I am excited because these Girl Scout, these Girl Scout cookies look really, really nice, look really, really yummy, and I can't wait to try all of them. I got eight of them right here right now with me, and um, yeah. Thank you, my friend Diana, for um, giving me, getting me all these boxes. They're a bit pricey, but it was for a fundraiser, and I am really, really glad that I got them. So, we are now going to try it. So, the first thing we're going to try is called Dosey Dos. This is crunchy oatmeal sandwich cookie with creamy peanut butter filling. Filling. Feeling? So, um, those of you guys that personally know me, I'm not really a big fan of oatmeal cookies. I'm a big fan of peanut butter because I love peanut butter so much. And yeah. Wow, this is nice. Alright. So just to let you know, all these cookies were in the fridge for a while. So I'm actually really excited. They're not all melted, hopefully not, and everything, so yeah. Alright, dosy dolls. Ooh, the smell of peanut butter, you can really, really smell it. Oh, but it tastes good. This actually tastes really good. This is like... This actually tastes like a regular basic peanut butter cookie. It tastes great. That's good. Um, three of these cookies are 160 calories. If you guys want to know about the calories, but that is really, really great. I'm into this. I'm into this. I'm gonna put this on the good side to show you which one I think, in my opinion, are really great. So, those those, these are gonna be on the side. The good side. Alright, next one we have is Thin Mints. Chris wafers covered in chocolatey coating made with natural oil of peppermint. So, this is chocolate and peppermint. I love chocolate so much. The only thing though is I'm not really a big fan of peppermint. And the reason why I'm not a big fan of peppermint is because, I don't know, the taste of it doesn't really look great to me. I have no idea why. Ooh, this looks really chocolatey. I like chocolate, so this is, this is pretty good. Whoa, yep, I can smell the peppermint. <clears throat> I can smell the peppermint from, from here. Wow, I just want to see if it tastes good or not though. So here we go. Mm. This is actually not bad. I feel like... Yep, yeah, this really tastes like peppermint, but the thing is it's chocolate, it's crunchy. I like crunchy and I like chocolate. I like dark chocolate more, but I like it. I like it. It has a ooh, really minty, minty breath. So I, I think I like this. I think I like the mints. I'm gonna put this on the good side too because that's just, that's actually pretty good. All right, next thing we have is called Savannah Smile. I have no idea why this is called Savannah Smiles. Maybe a girl named Savannah like made this cookie and she smiled. Chris zesty lemon wedge cookies dust with powdered sugar. Ooh. Okay. I like lemon flavor stuff. Lemon is actually pretty good. And also they said powdered sugar. Yes. Powdered sugar is life. <laughs> But seriously, I like powdered sugar. The only thing about powdered sugar that I don't like is that it gets really messy. And when it gets messy, it's, it's a pain to clean up. 
Okay, so it looks like a half cookie pretty much. Oh, just to let you guys know, the Thin Mints are four cookies per serving, 160 calories. Interesting. So anyways, this is what the fast smells look like. I don't smell any lemon, but um, I'm actually really glad to try. Mm. Okay. Well, I can taste the lemon now, but it's actually pretty good. The thing though is powdered sugar. Mmm, I don't know if you're supposed to taste powdered sugar because I can't taste any, but I can taste the lemon. Right after you like bite it or like even like lift, lift the powdered sugar, you can actually taste the lemon. But um, I say it's actually pretty good. The thing that's disappointing about this is that the powdered sugar doesn't really have a taste. Yeah, that's the only problem. So I'm, I'm going to leave this on the good side. Five cookies are 150 calories. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Next is called Tagalongs. For a sec, I thought this is Tagalog because I'm say I can say that because I am actually half Filipino and well, I know I'm Korean, but I'm also half Filipino too. And I literally thought this is Tagalog, and I was like. This is cookies made from the Philippines. That's pretty interesting. Um, crispy cookies layered with peanut butter and covered with a chocolate, chocolatey coating. Ooh, more chocolate. Yum. Whoa, okay. This is unexpected. It comes like this. That's, that's pretty interesting. It's like, it's pretty much like, um, Oreos, I guess you could say, you know, like how they have the tray and everything for Oreos. Yeah, I like those trays, but I also like how the flaps are. Yeah, so you can, you know what I mean. Whoa, okay, this smells like a Reese's, um, those Reese's, um, chocolates. That's really good, and I like Reese's too. I am happy to try this right now. I was right. It actually tastes like Reese's, those Reese's chocolates, but, which is a good thing because I love Reese's, so I love this. <laughs> no joke. It's actually really, really good. My gosh, this is totally going on the good side because honestly, that is just amazing. <laughs> Alright, so the next one we have is called Tray Foils. So, tray foils. This one is traditional shortbread cookies. Um, to be honest, I'm not really. Oh, I'm not really a big fan of uh, shortbread. I have no idea why. Oh, for the tagalongs, two of these cookies are 140 calories. Interesting. Anyways, like I said before, I'm not really a big fan of shortbread. I have no idea why, but yeah. Five of these cookies are 160 calories. Pretty interesting. Uh huh. Oh, very, very interesting. Okay, well, here's the thing about this. It breaks off really, really easily. It kind of looks like this. Oh uh, yeah, so it breaks off really easily, but yeah, maybe that's why I just call it shortbread. That just smells pretty good. Um, like I said before, I'm not a really big fan of shortbread cookies. Mmm. It's not really... I think the reason why is because this shortbread cookie tastes plain. I think that's the only reason. Five of these cookies are 160 calories. Pretty good, but the thing is that, um, there's no taste in them. I don't like cookies that taste 
plain. Um, I have no idea. I just, I have no idea. I just don't really like them as much as I, or I would expect it. So this is kind of going on the bad side. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. And the container, this box is blue, so I'm actually kind of sad. All right, next thing we have is Toffee Tastic. Oh, what's good about this? It's gluten free. Ooh, how interesting. Rich, buttery cookies with sweet, crunchy toffee bits. Ooh, okay. I love toffee. I like it a lot. I eat, I would eat a lot of it, but I'm afraid to eat a lot of it because I don't want to get that. Um, wow. Two cookies are 140 calories. Makes sense, so. Seriously, toffee. I remember the time when I was living in Michigan for two years. Um, one of my dorm mates actually like bought over toffee too for us to share or to try and uh, I would eat all of that. And then he got scared because he wanted to have some toffee and they were all, and they were all gone. That was me. Guilty! Sorry, that. Ooh, interesting. This smells plain. And like I said before, I don't like plain, but maybe if I bite it or eat it, I maybe it might change my mind. Whoa. Okay. I'm happy with this. This is this is really good. Mmm. Yum yum yum. This is really good. I can taste the toffee. I wouldn't care about the peanut butter, but I taste I can taste the toffee. That is excellent. I would mmm. I would highly recommend to buy that again. That was good. All right. Next we have is Girl Scout S'mores. S'mores, yes. Okay, I love s'mores. S'mores are good. Two, 150 calories for two cookies. Makes sense though. I love s'mores. I remember the good times when I went, when I went outside in camp. Um, we, I mean, I remember I used to make s'mores. I always add so, I always add like so much chocolate, but everyone else does. Um, and yeah, the chocolate, the marshmallows, the campfire, the one that the marshmallow was accidentally on fire. It comes in a tray, and that's actually pretty cool. Ah, ooh. Okay, let me tell you about this design right now. I am loving this design. I love it how this is s'mores, and I love how there's a picture right here. If you guys can see it, that's a really nice design. I'm not gonna lie, that looks really, really cool. This is amazing because also inside there's like the brown and the white. So that's the chocolate and the marshmallows. I am really happy to try this right now. Yeah, this is good. This is good. I am happy. I mmm. I'm happy I get to try this. This is just. Oh god, this is good. I guess the reason why is because I like s'mores, maybe because of the chocolate and stuff. But that is just really good. That brings back good memories. That is totally on the going on the good side. All right, we're down to our last ones. This is called Samoas. So, <laughs> here's the thing about Samoas though. Um, I remember this girl named Ro Rosanna. She doesn't like Samoa Samoas. I really was really shocked about it because I actually tried Samoa before, but I wonder if this is a different taste or something, maybe, maybe not. It's 150 calories for two cookies. 
You know, that's actually not that bad too. It comes, oh, it's a tray. Interesting. Ooh. That is a lot. But hey, chocolate. If you guys don't know what um, Samoa's is, crisp cookies coated in caramel, sprinkled with toasted coconut, and stripped with dark chocolate coating. Dark chocolate. Dark chocolate caught my attention because I love dark chocolate. That is like my number one chocolate that I would eat. Coconut, love the smell of coconut. Um, taste of coconut, on and off. Caramel, um, I, I'm okay with caramel. Ooh, yes, okay, this is, this is cool. This is really, this is really cool. I, I like it already. It's exactly what I pictured it would be and everything, so. Yeah. Ooh, here it is, and there's the chocolate. Ah, uh, I'm so sad that that Rosanna can't eat this because she's something about either like the flaky coconut or something that she doesn't like. Ah, uh, she's missing out. This is ah. Uh, well, this is the last one. Saving the best for last, I guess. Oh yeah, this is exactly what I expected, and I am very, very happy. It's amazing. Oh my gosh, yes. That jar of chocolate was amazing. That coconut was amazing. I don't taste any caramel. I don't know why, but that was amazing. Oh, that was so good. I am putting this on the good side as well. That is all the cookies I have. I'm sorry that that's a lot, even though there was only eight. Um, my favorite will be the Samoas, cause that is just good. Yum. That is amazingly good and I would eat this every day if I was on a diet and if I wasn't working out and if I, my metabolism is high. <laughs> yeah, there are a bunch of reasons why I would eat this. That's how good this is. You really need to try this because that is just good. I would also try the toffee, maybe just because I'm just a big toffee fan. Like toffee is just delicious. I, I recommend kids um, eating the s'mores because if you've never been outside, because I know a lot of kids these days, you don't go outside because of them playing video games and stuff. You guys are missing out because s'mores are like good. They're like the ultimate campfire snack that you need to eat. It's good. You will not regret it. For the other for the other ones, um I would recommend I would say the tacalongs too. Since the tacalong it tastes like Reese's. It's like I said, I'm a big fan of chocolate and Reese's the chocolate, the Reese's chocolate is actually really really great. The thin bits too are good too, but the only thing is I don't really care for the taste of peppermint, but um, if you ever want to eat a cookie and you need to go somewhere and without brushing your teeth, maybe this one. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't do that. Savannah Smiles. It's good because of the lemon. It's good because of the lemon, but the thing is I can't taste the powdered sugar at all if powdered sugar has taste. Dositos, I only like it because of the peanut butter filling inside. I'm not a big fan of oatmeal, so yeah. That's pretty nice. To that, this, Trifolos. I'm so sad that this isn't as good as all the other cookies are because I'm just, you know, this is shortbread and I'm not a big fan, like I said, I'm not a big fan of shortbread and I'm really sad this doesn't taste as good as I thought it would be. It's just too plain for me. I am sorry, but yeah, that was, that was actually really interesting. I'm really glad I get to try all these. And hopefully there are more videos like these because I like eating guilty. And these are just these are just amazing. And hopefully I will do another video like this again. Because this is this is just is just good. <laughs> anyway, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure this 
make sure you give this video a thumbs up comment down below subscribe to me so you can follow me on my youtube journey um once again thank you thank you um diana for the girl scout cookies i hope your friend has enough funds for whatever fundraiser there she's doing or whatever and i hope that they will get somewhere wherever that they're fundraising for i don't know i forgot but um yeah th these are really good this is a really great experience i'm really glad i get to try these um even though i'm by myself at home that face <laughs> Anyways, make every day a great day. See you guys in the next video. Be blue to yourself. Bye-bye.